In our obsession with antagonisms of the moment, we often forget how much unites all the members of humanity. Perhaps we need some outside universal threat to make us recognize this common bound. I occasionally think how quickly our differences worldwide would vanish if we were facing an alien threat from outside this world. And yet, I ask you, is not an alien force already among us? Hello. Hello, Art. Yes. Hi. Um, I, I, I don't have a whole lot of uh, time. Um, well, look, let's begin by finding out whether you're using this line properly or not. Uh, Area 51. Yeah, um, that's right. Were you an employee or are you now? Uh, I, a former employee. Former um, employee. I, I, I was let go on a medical discharge about a week ago. And, and... <laughs> I, I've kind of been running a, across the country. Um, oh man, I don't know where to start. They're uh, they're, they're gonna um, they'll triangulate on this position really, really soon. So um, you can't spend a lot of time on the phone. So give us something quick. Okay. Um. Um. Okay. What well, what we're thinking of as as aliens are they're uh, they're they're extra dimensional beings that. An earlier precursor of the um, space program made contact with. Uh, they they are not what they claim to be. Uh, they have infiltrated a lot of uh, uh, a lot of aspects of, of of the military establishment, particularly the Area 51. Uh, the, the disasters that are coming. They the, the military. I'm sorry, the, the government knows about them, and there's a lot of safe areas in this world that they could begin moving the population to now, Art. But they're not doing, they're not doing anything. They are not. They want the major population centers wiped out so that the, the few that are left will be more easily controllable. Discharge. <laughs> I, I started getting... In some way, something knocked us off the air and we're on a backup system now. It's uh, the government or... I don't know. It has to be something though. Well, did you hear... Now, you tell me because you were listening. That was awful strange. There was a really weird guy on the air when it went off? Yeah. Real weird out. Like uh, going sort of sort of sounding paranoid, yeah. schizophrenic? Like crying and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And how far into the conversation was it when, when it went off? It just a couple, about 15, 20 seconds. I'd say. Oh, you, like you guys missed, you, you really missed the call then, and I've got a feeling somebody didn't want you to hear it. Yeah. Because <laughs> um, it was really strange, all of a sudden I'm hearing Mark Furman. And when I, when That's I was right, well the network, the network of course went immediately to a backup tape while we tried to figure out what blew up here. Uh-huh. So that's what you heard happen. Uh-huh. And then we're now on a backup link system.